Welcome boys and girls, I'm Scuba Winters, and today we are playing Clue on the Super Nintendo. Why? Because why not? Clue is actually really fun on the Super Nintendo since I never actually played the actual board game. But the streamlines a lot of just the like, how does the game work and whatnot and just automates a lot of stuff. So we're just going to jump into it. Gonna do medium difficulty. Um, let's let's go four players. Since I'm just gonna go alone, going against the computer, I put it on medium difficulty, and I'm gonna go. I'm gonna be Colonel Mustard. Yes, we're gonna go. And here I just pick all the computers. Let's go, Professor Plum. And the last one, we'll go Mr. Green. Okay. We start up. Okay, yeah, so we have our cards here. Anything on this list is something that is innocent. So Professor Plum, not the murderer. Whoever has the lead pipe, not the murderer. Whoever had the wrench, also not the murderer. Whoever was in the hall or conservatory, also not the murderer. Hopefully those any of these combinations don't get combined. Because that's always a shame. Kind of a waste of cards if that happens. So, okay, I am not. Okay, I guess I'm not first. <laughs> okay, so we have, we can just roll. We have an interrogation and an accusation. Accusation is the like final answer. If you fail to get this wrong, you're automatically out of the game. Uh, interrogation you get like a a trial run to like see if anybody has any cards to see if they have any evidence against uh, what you're saying is the person, weapon, or place. So if, if someone does have a card, they're like, ah, that can't be true, I have proof. But if this, nobody shows up, and it's like, hmm, that could, that could work then it's most likely the right answer. And then here we go to whatever place to just throw out a guess. We're in the dining room. We're gonna go, I guess it was, the, it's always the maid. Made with the gun. And here we'll get a little piece of information. And I like the little like, dramatization they have to it. This is why it was not in the dining room. Okay. Sometimes you get some good information, sometimes you don't. But yeah, uh, if you go into... I know there's a specific term for what I just did, but you can't use an interrogation after this. You have to go into an accusation. Which, you better be right. <laughs> Okay, so we're in the ballroom. Look at Mrs. White. Oh, Mrs. White with a candlestick. And I love the music. It just fits so well for this game as well. Yes, it was in the conservatory. Okay. Where's the conservatory on the map? Oh, the conservatory's on the way left. Which you can use... Which you can teleport from... Oh, I guess you can't teleport from the lounge. Okay, and I'm like the furthest away. Okay, let's... Let's make our way down to the conservatory, because now we got some connection. Yo, Miss Peacock... Pe oh, Miss Pe Peacock in the... With the knife? Okay, and then I was not in the study. Well, that's okay. Again, kind of a like, it's not here, so it's not much of an evidence, you know, much information. Also, sometimes uh, people can not have a weapon. So that can really throw some stuff off. Okay, going for the lounge.
Okay, didn't have the knife. Okay. Okay, well, we'll go to the ballroom. This white with the candlestick. Let's see if we can get more information on this. Oh, I'm gonna hit the button. And uh, again, it's telling me things where it wasn't. Give me, give me some actual good info, please. Okay. Since I have the card, this can draw off some, some information. Oh, okay. So in turn, knife not the murder weapon. Oh yeah, also, oh yeah, suggestions, what the thing is. Also, if you get called for a suggestion, you get warped to that room. Was not in the ballroom. Good, and they're all like, ooh, there's a... There's a thing. I just hope I don't get freaking called up. Okay, damn it. Okay, so... <laughs> Everybody's trying to go to the conservatory. Just why the candlestick? We already know that. Uh, Miss White had it. Miss Green was in the dining room. Okay. Okay. So let's. Also, you cannot back out, so you have to like definitely make sure. You know, like, you press the right button. Oh my god, they could... Okay. Wait, was it the candlestick in the conservatory? Oh, you bitch. Also, you can be the murderer. And you, you do get a slightly different ending if you win and you're also the murderer. <gasps> we do have Mr. Green in the dining room. Who's going to guess it? It's going to be me. Me with the candlestick. Okay. So we got a person, place, and thing now. Oh, you can't just use a suggestion from there? Okay. Not in the lounge. I gotta make my way to... Wait, can I? God damn it. Wait, is there a... Okay, yeah, I can... I can warp... I think I can three again. Yeah, because you can take a... You can take a warp to the other end. Not have the wrench. Okay. We're, we're getting there. What sucks is the computers are starting to figure out, like, hey, Mr. Green's up to something. Might be it. 
I'm going for it. Mr. Green. Rope. Dining room. Okay. And now we do like a little theatrical sort of play style of... Here's how it all went down. The dishes were set. And tidy rows across the dining room table. Mr. Green waited with anticipation. He quickly coiled the rope. God damn it. And I'm certain it could have been me. I have proof. Oh, he had the rope card. Well, shit. Well, back to Mrs. White. <laughs> Actually, I forgot what weapon cards I have. I think I have the wrench and something else. I was not in the conservatory. Ironically enough, now I am. Okay, what are, what are you doing? Oh yeah, they're still thinking it's the knife. Mr. Plum with the knife. He was not in the billiard room. Sorry, bro. Also, I need to like recheck my cards. I, I kind of forgot what I had. And now I'm gonna get warped to the top. You bitch. It was not in the lounge, huh? Okay. Oh, I get an extra siege interrogation. I guess I get two? Okay, lead pipe wrench. The hall. Um... I'm gonna just throw out Miss Peacock. Miss Peacock with a gun. Oh. Peacock was in the ballroom. Okay. Oh, and I'm in the lounge anyways. <laughs> okay, so ball, where's the ballroom? Did, we, did it show what weapon she had? Oh, the scarlet was in the lounge. What weapon did she have? Yeah, there's two. Candlestick? Oh. She, her with the gun in the lounge. Who's gonna pull it? Damn it. Please somebody have the card. Or, or this game's over. The lounge was quite warm. It was cozy enough for a nap. A long nap. Miss Scarlet laughed as she fixed her, her makeup and hair. She reached for the revolver. Damn it, she wins. Hmm, that's an interesting possible scenario. But what's funny is she's outing herself as the murderer, so we do get a slightly different ending. Accusation. And there we go. Well, that was this episode, so I hope you all enjoyed this episode. It's literally the same dialogue. And there is a slightly different scene. Bang! She's been hurt enough. Bang! Fun. And. Well, well, I won. I figured it, figured it out. I cracked the case. Get your hands off me. You good? I'll go peacefully. So I did it. Come with me, boys. <laughs> I guess she's like okay with uh, getting arrested. So that that was cool. <laughs> well, that was fun. Maybe I'll do some episodes and hopefully try to win next time. But I do like other people's have like, ha ha! No one else could have figured it. Wait. Oh no! 
What did I do? I think like Mr. Plum does that if he's the murderer, but he also wins. But either way, that was a fun little time. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun YouTube stuff. And I hope to see you all again on the next episode. I'm the Google Winters, and I hope you all have a very good day. Bye.